Hey guys, it's Ty. Thanks for watching The Fumble. For all the latest news on all your favorite athletes, make sure to hit subscribe. All right, we started hearing rumors of Carmelo Anthony's departure from the Rockets. Then the GM came out and said, oh, that's hollywash. Pollywash. No, really, Dave, what is the saying? Basically, he said that these rumors were inaccurate to try and throw us off. Why? Okay? If you know, we know. Don't try and throw us off only for the truth to come out four days later because you know what you look like? A liar. The Rockets and Mello have officially parted ways and everyone is reacting, especially his former teammates in Houston. Here's what James Harden had to say. He's one of my friends, great guy, great teammate, but it just didn't work out. It's part of the business. Okay, so Harden likes him, but is glad he left confirmed. Then we have CP3, who advocated for Melo to sign with the Rockets in the first place, and who is part of the Banana Boat and Vino Club with Melo, LeBron, and D-Wade. Here's what he had to say. I mean, it's tough. It's tough. Uh, you know, some guys in this league, they're your teammates, but Melo's my family. You know, so for me, it's all about his happiness at the end of the day. And, uh, you know, that's, that's what everybody's going to work on. Now, as most of you know, D-Wade came out and really stood up for Melo when these reports first surfaced earlier in the week. He sent out a tweet and said, trying to make my guy Carmelo the fall guy, huh? Y'all need to stop. That's the easy way out instead of addressing what the real problem is. But who's the real problem? Name names. You won't. I think what D Wade and a few other NBA fans aren't quite getting <clears throat> by other NBA fans. <clears throat> I'm talking to Chris who edits the fumble. <clears throat> is that no one is necessarily making Carmelo the fall guy for the team, okay? No one is saying that the Rockets' troubles are all his fault. The point is, he's not helping their troubles. He is making them worse. Houston had a net rating of minus nine with Melo on the court and a rating of minus 0.2 with him off it. Now, Houston's problems weren't his fault, but he wasn't helping the existing problems, guys. But when it's all said and done, it's done, okay? Now the question is, what's next for this man? I personally don't think he's done in the league, and I don't think he should be done. What I think he needs to do is put in the work, like LeBron-level work, okay? Carmelo was a great player deep, deep down inside. But I can tell you the Puerto Rican Basketball Federation is currently trying to recruit Melo to play for their national team. Melo was born in New York, but his parents are Puerto Rican. Think they have a shot? Drop a comment and let me know. Or just let me know what this man needs to do and I'll tweet out some of your responses directly at him so we can help save this man's life. As promised, today's post notification shout out goes to Kenneth Lou Saint. If you want to see more of your girl, you can follow me on the gram and Twitter at Taiwan on Sports. I'm going to be commenting back on all of today's videos, so make sure you say hi. Make sure you're subscribed to the Noti Gang for a shout out. Much love, fam.